the brawler. The brawler was really hard. From the back of the van where Will abused Kaz was really hard because he, he went me. I, you know, I asked for it. I could rip your head off right now and no one would give a shit. And he went me and he scared the bejesus out of me, for real. I'd actually have to say that the, the scenes that I found most difficult to watch were things like the, the lynching. The lynching scene with Ferguson was pretty extraordinary to watch, not to mention the final burial. I didn't like watching the elevator scene. <laughs> it was just, they're just horrible scenes to do. I, I did find watching the Shiv scene quite hard. I actually had a, a bit of a weep after that shooting that for hours because your body, there's something about the adrenaline, your body still thinks I've just had a knife held to my throat. After shooting that, I, I did have a bit of a weep and rocked in a corner for a little while. So that was that was pretty difficult. Emotionally, the scene, scene, the scene in the showers with Liz was pretty challenging to watch because it's awful to see Lizzie go through that, you know, which is what Boomer was feeling too. Like she comes in with one agenda and ends up leaving completely confused and what the hell just, happened. I just saw my surrogate mum ripping her hairs out of her head and melting down. So that was pretty full on. You are a, a serial liar! Can't fucking help yourself, can you? No, don't. I mean, I think it was probably the stuff in the bathroom when Boomer comes in. It was quite weird to watch it back because it was, I didn't realise how distressing it was. Fuck it up! Fuck it up! Fuck it up! Fuck it up! Yeah, because when you're filming it, you're actually oddly, not that you're in control, but you know where you're going. You've given yourself a kind of basic map. But when you watch it back, you see yourself from a different perspective. So it was quite distressing. On an emotional level, I found it really difficult to watch Ali burning uh, all of these sketches because it was her only tangible memory of B now B only exists in her mind, she's got nothing left of her.